point of this, and this is Skellige, but you know, <laughs> lots of people are still going to be playing Nilfgaard. Um, okay, too early for Morvid to be useful. Don't need two of these things. I don't need two of these things, but we'll keep the premium version. <sighs> I don't know, maybe it's just my luck tonight. Like, the draw doesn't seem like it's a, a useful one. I mean, there are good things in there, like I've got the cat and this, but I don't want to play them early. It's fine, we'll start with the lava. What? Lava, damsel... Fiend? Maybe Witch Prentice. Melusine. Which gain veil. Spawn rain on the enemy row for two turns. Anyway. Um at the end of your turn, damage ad adjacent units by one and gain one base power for each damage. Okay, so that thing needs to go away. But how? Seven. So I could stick this down. It would end up with I could then boost it by five. So it'd be on nine, but it needs to be on fourteen to kill it. I, mean, I could just heat wave it, but it seems very early to use up my one heat wave. Don't know. It seems like an important card, and it's the same cost, so let's just do it. If it's the wrong call, it is the wrong call. The realm of the living severs your chain. Abandon now your mortal stain. That's a nice rhyme. He's going to purify someone. This looks like he's gearing up to pass, so we won't play anything um, too amazing. I want to play my Thrive then. If I'm not expecting him to keep going for much longer, then I should just play this one. Again, I'm making assumptions, which is maybe leading to bad play, but um, I'm okay with bad play. Yeah, we'll have Koshi in there so that we can have at least the mana. Mana Cat and Koshi. Oh, I should have. Why don't I do that? He's going to play at least one more card, but then I'm going to be forced into another card. Yes. He's definitely going for a short round. Why don't I... Anyway. Um, let's force it. And by force it, I mean... I don't know what I mean. Play that, and make sure it doesn't go over. Nine. So maybe, like, I don't know, I'm still kind of expecting him to pass, but he's behind on points. And ahead on a card. So he's going to pass? Yes. So at least I could see that coming. I don't know if it's um, going to help me. Because I have my Thrive set up. Can I do it with one card less than him? Like, do I push him in this round? What have I got? One, two... Oh. Yeah, he's got a card more. Do I... I mean, I do have two Thrive things... Not useful. Well, I mean, it is, but... You'd say push. Yeah. I think it makes sense. Nine cards, he may have one extra, but... Again, he didn't spend a lot of provision in that round except for the first card. Worst case, I start playing these things, and... If it starts going badly, then... There's not much I can do. Well, no, I can just pass at that point. Uh, Sigvald, whenever this unit is damaged by other non-status abilities, gain bleeding for the same duration instead. Or to damage a unit by the duration of bleeding on self, then purify self. If it was an enemy unit, damage self by that amount. If it was an allied... There's just so many words there. Like, I could damage it with Parasite, and then kill it with Damsel. 
if I wanted to. I don't know if I want to. Um, you can't damage her? Can't, I mean... Oh, it will gain bleeding. Fine. Then we just go... Hello. I'm glad you're here. Because <laughs> otherwise I would have done it. Damage on allied unit by half of its current power. Kill him. This guy. Berserk 5. At the end of your turn, refresh this ability. So he's going to keep damaging him, is that it? And then he's going to hit me? Or you want me to kill this guy now? No, he's not going to die. So you want me to kill this guy. Um, But I, I would either need 10 on these two to be able to do that, or I can just Parasite. It's a shame that I don't have one damage, because then I could Toad him. Yeah, okay, Canoe. Let's just go with that. Then. Yeah, as I say, it's a shame I um, couldn't do it without the Parasite, but I suppose I have Parasite for a reason. Oh, and he's back. He is back again. But he's doomed. Berserk 5 is if he... If he goes down to that power. So if I damage him a little, then that's bad. Not that I can damage him a little. Um, I mean... They have three revives. Let's... Okay, so I should ignore reviving things and stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I should be playing the cat this time. When you say revives, you mean the card they just played? Like this... This is one... So they've got another one of these cards and like two different cards as well. Oh no, that's gold. Damage all units by one. Okay. Now, if I wanted to, I could eat this with Toad. I could also eat that with Toad. Because this has an order to damage a unit by the duration of bleeding. So he's got five bleeding. Like, next turn he could just kill something. I really want to use Koshi, but... Sounds decent when he falls in their deck. Okay. We'll go with that. Um, and I won't play the cat... I don't know if they have good attacking stuff. Damage will one of the units. Mm, it's fine. I will not play it this turn, just to keep its immunity. I'm sure they'll have something which is like, damage all units. But... Damage the units to the right by one, then boost off by two. Yeah, whenever there's a bear abomination, which... He managed to get. So I need to avoid this losing health, but it's going to. Um, right, well, let's do our thing. Put you on this row. Annoyingly, you do trigger Thrive. Okay. Is that all I want to do? Do you still do something? At the end of your turn, damage units to the right by one and boost off by two. So let's get rid of you. I don't know if actually this was a better target. You say he has revives, so I'm sure it will come back anyway. This is going to come out and he's going to damage me. 
it's also... How's he getting more of these things? He's... Like, I understand that they're turning into bear abominations, but I don't understand how he keeps getting new ones. There is a second revive. So he's revived this guy. Hmm. Play a non-neutral unit from your graveyard with a provision cost of 10 or less and give it doomed. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, what I want to do is... I don't know. Well, I should probably kill that if I can with this thing. Because of the bear guy, second to the left, you should consume him early in early next round. If there is a next round. Um, right, we're going to cut. We're going to kill this guy. Maybe could have done it first. And then we're going to consume the fiend. Oh, I should have consumed something bigger. Rubbish. I had the right idea, I just didn't have the right... idea. Heal an allied unit, and then boost it by five? I mean, not that useful. Um, I mean, it is going to trigger Thrive, but not as much as it really should do. It's fine. Or maybe I should have... Yeah, I should have played this first. Again, if it's a difference of one point or something, then that'll be it. I mean, he's going to have two more cards to play. He's playing Resilience things. I feel like there's going to be another round and I'm going to lose it because I've played all my good cards. Um, so I have a 7. You'd pass. What, to leave me with one card? I mean, he needs 20 points, so we might use both cards to do it. Yeah, up, up to me, I know, but I, I don't really know. Um, so I could, if I play this, I'll get a boost of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, plus whatever I'm doing with that. I think I play, because I've got this out. I think it boosts me just enough. I think, I hope that a 46 point swing is just beyond him. It's a hope because I know this is Gwent and every time you think you maybe have enough points that you probably don't have enough points. Reset the power. Okay. So what, it's down to 29? And now he's got this. Damage down a large unit by two. I mean, he's he has to think hard to see if he's got the win here. Is that it? No, he's... There you go. I have no idea what he did. What did he do? Not you again. Whenever you play an alchemy card, like, he did something which... Did so much damage. Right, short round three doesn't help. Um, I mean, I can pull out a Morvid or a Yig, that's fine. With the Nagglefar. Uh, Thrive isn't useful. Okay. I have pulled some very big cards here. You short round is better. I mean, only because I got the high 
power cards, but I mean, generally, a Thrive deck, you want a long round, don't you? Maybe? Yes. Okay, fine, he banishes it. I can't lock anything. So I play it and just, well, my half plan was maybe to lock Yig so he didn't have the damage on it, but... Um, resilience. I mean, it does have an order. Maybe I can lock it. I do not no. Words on principle. Well, there you go. I'll lock his doomed unit. It's, it's for a unit. So, lock is fine. Yeah, it's just not what I was hoping for. And he gets to pull out any card from his deck. Any card. That's a powerful card to have at the end here. When we have so few cards, you can just pull out your best one. I mean, I'm going to do something similar. Five points. But he's going to damage it by two. It's going to transform into a bear abom abomination. Okay. I don't have to play it on a special road, do I? No. I mean, nothing beats Morbid here. Good game. Thank you. <laughs> um, you say nothing beats Morvid. I'm sure there is something. There must be something out there in that deck which randomly has some, like, eat a bear abomination. Because I don't... I still don't know what he did without playing a card which got rid of, like, 40 points. I may need someone to clear that up in a minute. Or, you know, some point in the future. Order 500 units during online matches. Wow. Again, I'll go play with my reward points at some point. But for now, we'll just keep keep ranking up. Uh, I was the bear guy. He is insane. If left alone in the long round. Yes. And I think I did leave him al al alone in the long round. Um, I didn't have... I used up my control things before. And so didn't have the... You know ability to get rid of it at that time, which is maybe, I was going to say my mistake, and I did make some mistakes in that game, um, but still, coming out with the win, lead was perfect, imagine him in round three, I mean, he had ten cards in round two, so, but it would have been equally annoying, I suppose, yeah, or like, I would have lost that round three, and if it was round three, then there wasn't a chance to win from that point. Like, if you lose round three, you lose the game. Right, too early for Morbid. Um, Koshi. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then please leave a like. And if you think you would enjoy more, then please subscribe or even join me live on Twitch. Whilst it's cliche, all of these will help the channel. On screen is something carefully curated or something the YouTube algorithm suggests, or maybe even both. In any case, have a great day.